Hi you guys, I just made it to New Orleans, just got in the room and I am in shock. It is so beautiful and I have to just give you guys a room tour because you need to see this. So I'm going to give you guys a little room tour. By the way, this hotel is absolutely gorgeous. It's like a little boutique hotel, but here's um, like a little dresser, mirror dresser when you first walk in the door. To the left is this gorgeous bathroom. All the marble is like so stunning and they left so many fun products i can't wait to do some get ready um with me's in here stick my phone with my octo buddy on the mirror it's gonna be the perfect filming spot and here is the tub and the shower i cannot wait to hop in here i just need to like wash off i feel like i am sweating because when i got in here for some reason the heater was on but here is the bedroom with these little goodies that they left I cannot believe this. I just think it is so sweet. So little monogrammed PJs and then I need to like dig further what's in this box but immediately I saw the cold Gaia bag and I was freaking out. Okay so we have some little earrings and a card. YSL Black Opium. Oh my goodness this perfume smells so good and I don't know if these are alcoholic or not is it a, oh it's energy drink okay i don't drink these but still cute this quote gaia bag i do not own one of these but i just think they're so beautiful so i can't believe that and then we have some desi sunglasses i actually should have told them that i don't drink alcohol because maybe they would have put like sparkling apple cider or something but that's champagne and something else alcoholic so won't be touching any of that, but I'm starving, so maybe I'll eat the apple. And then we have this makeup station over here with all of the foundations and their shades, and then um, some lip products, and then this L'Oreal Lift Mascara, the telescopic lift. Y'all know I love like the regular L'Oreal telescopic, so I'm super excited to try this. We have one event tonight at 6.30, it's in the hotel lobby, and I think we're just like having dinner. It's like a little cocktail hour too, just to like meet everyone. So it's like almost two right now. So probably start getting ready around like four and I need to like eat something. I'm absolutely starving and then edit some stuff on my phone. But like I said, I'm just so excited to be here. I feel really weird here by myself. Like I wish there was someone here with me. I don't know anyone here. I've just like seen, um, some of the girls online but i don't know anyone personally so i'm excited to like meet some new people but i'm gonna bring you guys along on the vlog for the entire thing i'm gonna try to get a workout in tomorrow and we'll just see where the days take us but it's time to order some food because i am starving okay so nothing really sounded good to be on the room service menu so i went on DoorDash doordash and ordered some shake shack I love their chicken burger. It is like so good. So I got that and some fries. I'm not gonna eat on the bed. I'm gonna try to go eat over there and make some space. I am like so tired. The sleepiness is kicking in. I didn't even wake up that early. It was like six when I woke up. So I need to like get it together. But let me show you guys this sandwich. I always get it with no sauce. I'm just not a big sauce person. Like. I've never been like I don't really like mayo. It's just not my thing. Mmm, looks so good. It originally comes with like herb mayo. I just like got it without. It has pickles and lettuce on it, and this bun is like a brioche bun. And then the fries. <laughs> ketchup. I was scared they weren't gonna give me ketchup, but they did. I feel so weird being here by myself. Like, what am I supposed to do? My fiance's at work, so I can't call him. Maybe I'll call Alina and talk to her. I just eat a really quick fry. I've never been to New Orleans before. It's like really close to Texas. It's only like an hour flight. And the drive is probably like four hours. It's not a uh, far place. No. Mmm. Oh, I brought a bunch of like healthy snacks. <laughs> That's funny. I'm still gonna eat them, but it's all about balance. 
And I also brought magnesium gummies in case I get like anxiety. I get anxiety sometimes. I brought my CBD, my peppermint tea. Kind of stay calm. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna eat this and then probably wash off in the shower. I'm editing a mini vlog for TikTok. And then we'll start getting ready. I just washed off in the shower because I felt like so sweaty after the airplane and everything and it feels so much better. So now I am fresh faced and about to do some skincare. I didn't really bring that many skincare products, but honestly, I've just been keeping it super simple lately. Like I was talking about in my last video, I feel like less is truly more. They have some serums here. Let's see, what is this? There's a vitamin C serum, and then this is the hyaluronic acid serum. I've seen ads for this on TikTok, I believe. And then this is Revitalift. Hyaluronic acid and caffeine. I think oh this is for your under eyes. So that'll be fun to use in the morning I don't know why I always feel so weird about like showing toilets in the background But if I close the door then it messes up my, my other shots. So just ignore the toilet, okay? I've been loving this Caudalie moisturizer. It makes my skin feel so soft. It's like amazing. Also, I did Dermaplane yesterday, so that's also part of the reason, but it's really nice. So it is, what time is it? Four o'clock and I need to be down there by like 6.20. Um, so I think this is enough time. I usually like to start on my hair first. It was curled, but it's definitely not anymore. Oh, my got it kind of humid in the shower. So we're going to fix this first. I'm going to blow dry like the front a little bit because it got kind of wet in the shower. When I'm not using my Dyson, I like to curl my hair with the T3. This is the 1.25 inch. I'm kind of nervous for tonight. I'm just like kind of shy. I don't know, I'm really not, but I'm just not like super comfortable in like large groups where I don't know anyone. That's like a very out of my comfort zone kind of situation. So I'm a little nervous. I mean, I know it's gonna be fine, but you know, it's just like one of those things. Last night I was going to sleep and I'm like, this is the feeling of like, what it used to be like on your first day of school you're like excited but nervous because there's like new people new things it's literally the same feeling but i did meet two girls in the bus and they were super sweet um i'm sure everyone else will be too Okay, her is done. It's like really tight curls right now, but I'm gonna wait for it to cool down. Then we'll brush it out. I hung my little, um, you can't see it, my Amazon toiletry bag right here. I'm just gonna throw my skincare products back in there. I love that um, little thing, it's so convenient. It's funny because I'm seeing all the girls' like stories and everyone's like doing the same thing. Wearing our robe, getting ready filming it's just funny okay i just finished my makeup and my hair i'm really happy with the way it turned out thankfully i feel like um i was saying on my tiktok whenever you try like hard to do your makeup you're like oh i want it to look really good today it always ends up looking bad but i feel like I did a pretty good job but i just wanted to say this because this is like really bothering me and i don't know i just need to get it off my chest so the earthquake and the disaster in Turkey and Syria literally just happened yesterday and my thoughts and prayers are still with those who have been harmed. Like it breaks my heart, like the tragedy that these people have suffered and like nobody truly deserves to go through that. And I just like can't imagine and we're truly so blessed just to have like basic 
human necessities like being here on like this amazing trip and having like all these things that are like totally unnecessary it just really makes me feel like guilty because I know that there are like more important things in, going on in the world right now and I just want you guys to know that I'm not just here like oh like hi look at me um it may seem that way I really hope it doesn't but like truly my thoughts and prayers are like still with all of those families who have suffered and I've been trying to share some like good um charities to donate to on my Instagram I just really hope those who have suffered losses can like find peace and just I really hope God can get them through this time it's just such a tragedy but I just want you guys to know if any of your families have suffered losses or have been affected by this I truly am praying for you because I cannot imagine the pain you are going through and I am praying there with you guys so now I'm gonna go get dressed it's about 5.45. I'm doing pretty good on timing. Um, I'm gonna head downstairs like 6.20, but I wanna film some other things before that. And yeah, I just finished getting dressed and like touching up my hair, my lipstick. I'm just gonna spray some perfume. Then I'll be ready to go. I'm literally like right on time. I'm very proud of myself. Well, I probably should put in a little bit more jewelry so let me go get that i think i'm just gonna wear these gold hoops and no necklace the gloss that i'm wearing is patrick ton the shade she's no superficial let me show you guys my full outfit before i walk out the door okay here's the fit the theme for tonight is like gym tone so i'm wearing this like deep purple sequin dress some Zara heels and then my Dior bag. I was gonna wear the Colt Guy one that they gave us, but I wanted to wear this because I brought it, so might as well. But I'm gonna gather my things together, take a few more little pictures, and then we'll head downstairs. It was super fun. Um, it was just like a little cocktail mingling hour. And then this was waiting for me on the bed when I got back in the room. This is my profile photo that I use for like all my accounts. Oh my god. That's so cute. That's when I had short hair. I need to update the photo. But that is so sweet. Literally it even has my necklace. And then the boxes. What could be in here? Let's open it. Okay, it says there's a true match for everyone. Let's find yours. Lost pattern. Oh, wait. Ah, cute. Little scarf. This was like on the mood board. You can like tie this in your hair and do like a cute fun hairstyle. That is so cute. More Desi sunglasses. Mm, I'm not gonna put these on, but those are adorable. So Skims. <gasps> oh my god. This is a Skims shirt. Are you kidding me? Hell yeah. <laughs> I, I love Skims. That's so exciting. I have all their bodysuits, but I like this because it's just a t-shirt and it's so that's super sweet. That is so cute. Like, what the heck? I can't get over that. <laughs> I love it. I feel like anytime I've had like a picture painted of me or something, it never looks like me, but this is pretty close. Totally ready to take off this dress and change into some comfy clothes. Um, we didn't eat dinner and I'm pretty hungry, so I'm gonna probably order something again. I don't like eating out this much, but what else is a girl going to do when she's hungry? I'm going to try to like clear.
clean up this bathroom a little bit. I didn't make too big of a mess, but I just want to like clean it up a bit and not leave it a mess. Um, tomorrow, the first event, we're going to like a painting class. We have to be down in the lobby at 9.15, which isn't too early. Guys, look at my makeshift tripod. I didn't have anything tall enough to put my camera on, so that's what I was using. That's so funny. sleep very well last night um i don't know i just like kept waking up i feel like when it's not your own bed especially me like sleeping by myself in a hotel room which just like wasn't the most um comfortable night's sleep but i'm feeling okay i woke up at like 7 30 did my skincare brushed my teeth washed my face all of that and now i'm getting ready for the morning portion of the day Fuck. So we have to be down in the lobby by like 9.15. Again, we're going to like a painting studio for like a painting class, which I don't really know oops, what that's going to be, but I'm excited. I ordered some Starbucks to the room. I just ordered like a matcha because I need a little caffeine boost for the day. And I'm just going to do like really light makeup because um, after like this morning, little event we have some free time and i'm gonna go work out and then um we have a dinner tonight so i'm not gonna do like full glam makeup i'm just gonna have like a light face on i've been using the super goop glow screen lately and i love it like i forgot how glowy this makes your face and just gives you like a tiny bit of color this is what i wore yesterday like traveling like literally that just this on my face and i even got compliments on like my skin they're like oh my god you look so glowy i'm like wait what do i have on my skin <laughs> it was just like glow screen latte with one cup of vanilla and cinnamon powder so good it's like not too sweet i don't like sweet um drinks especially in the morning mm. it's perfect mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Hey, no. okay i am dressed for the day and i want to show you guys my outfit so this is what I'm wearing. I'm so glad I got these pants in a bigger size this time because I love the little bit like slouchy look. I think it looks really nice. And then my white Nike sneakers. I got um, these two tops from Aritzia the other day and I like them for just basics. YSL bag and then my Amazon, oh, Amazon sunnies. 
so this is the master class we're going to today it's all about their foundation and i am excited i think it's going to be good but i need to head downstairs I want to kind of explain like what it was because it was super loud in there and I couldn't talk but I definitely got some clips so it was a little foundation master class and they had each girl's um, portrait there that was like unpainted and then there was like different shades and we were supposed to like um, create our own foundation shade I did not do a very good job mine was like a very orange and like not the right tone but it was really fun i had a good time and some of the girls just went to lunch but i like needed to come back to my room and like decompress i had like um some things to edit and i'm gonna break into my snack bag um i think i'm gonna eat that apple that's over there but i brought some popcorn and what i really want right now is one of these kind bars but i also have um some pretzels and then some almond butter so I'm gonna eat this it's like 12 15 right now we don't have to be ready again until like 4 30 so I'm gonna edit a few things um, I'm gonna try to go work out but I don't know if I'm gonna have enough time I should they gave each girl an apron with our name on it super cute and I realized like the process of like creating foundation shades is like way more complex and complicated than like than I ever thought she was kind of explaining how they do it and like the process of everything and I was like wow that is way more complex than I ever thought it's a few hours later I was just doing some stuff on my phone posting a few things and I just got dressed for the gym it's like 1 30 right now and we need to be ready by 4 30 so I don't have too much time I'm just gonna do like a quick 45 minute or even 30 minute workout I think I want to do 12 3 30 on the treadmill I've been doing that recently and I've been loving it it's when you put the Incline on 12, the speed on 3, and you do that for 30 minutes, and it makes your booty burn, and it gets my heart rate, like, really up, so I feel like that's a good, like, just quick little workout. Then I'll come back, shower, get dressed, and um, I've tried to, like, keep the place pretty tidy, so packing tonight shouldn't be too hard, but let me grab my AirPods, noise-canceling AirPod Pros. These are the best, and my room key my phone and let's go do a little workout i just got ready for the last night i did my hair and this bun, this is the same one I did for Amanda's Galentine's party. Like it's such a fun, like little quick and easy hairstyle. I actually filmed it for real, so that'll be up soon. But let me show you guys my outfit. So the theme tonight is like pops of pink. So I'm wearing these heels. They're not really my style exactly. Like I bought these specifically for this outfit. And they're not my fave, but I'm just going with the vibe. And then I'm wearing this black, it's kind of hard to see, but it's a black satin um, pantsuit. It has a little tie in the front. This is from Nasty Gal. 
And then I'm gonna wear the little Colt Gaia bag that they gifted us. It is, it's so pretty. It just doesn't fit much, doesn't even fit my phone. So I'm gonna have to carry my phone and my camera, but that's okay. So I think the plan for tonight is to drive over to another hotel. I think we're gonna have dinner at the Four Seasons. And I think that'll be it. This has honestly been so fun and just such like a great experience. I'm so happy that I came and so grateful to be invited. I added some jewelry because I feel like I needed a little something. So I put these gold hoops on and then I'm wearing these necklaces. The gold chain is Missouri and then this diamond one is... Miranda Fry. I think I've done a good job both nights with like timing and getting ready, which I'm happy about. I just like did not want to be late anywhere. So I'm gonna go ahead and head downstairs. I just finished putting everything in my suitcase and it is now like five pounds heavier so now I think my bag is 60 pounds I just I don't know why I do this to myself every time like why do I need 60 pounds worth of stuff for three days like please tell me last night was really fun um so we went to the Four Seasons Hotel we had cocktail hour on the rooftop and they did like a little mascara tour experience so they shared like different fun facts about the mascara through these like different exhibits and they had a drone show at the end which i had never seen before and it was so cool and then we went down to the restaurant and had dinner um the food like was not very good and it took forever but the dessert was amazing and then i came back to the hotel showered packed up all my stuff and me and Usama were on the phone for like an hour because we both like couldn't sleep and then I finally went to sleep around midnight and now here I am up early and ready to go and finish chugging some water take one last loop around the room to make sure I didn't forget anything so we have to be down at the lobby by 8 30 and um, my flight leaves at 11 so I'll have some time at the airport to like do some work um I catch up on like my phone and my computer and i need some caffeine and some breakfast this is actually probably going to be the end of the vlog so that i can start editing it but i'm so glad i got to bring you guys along with me for this trip i'm so grateful for this experience and honestly i just can't believe that i got to come and it was super fun i had a really good time i am exhausted and like my social battery is drained so i am very ready to go home but i love you guys so so much and thank you if you made it all the way to the end of this video i will see you guys in the next one bye guys